there are two ways to resolve a problem. First, the traditional linear model, where you look at each part along a line to identify where the problem is. Or the nonlinear approach, where you look at impacts, interactions, and flows. This model allows you to see interlinks and relationships between the elements of the system. The primary advantage of the nonlinear model is that you can run simulations that allow you to see behavior over time. More importantly, it allows you to see how changes over time impacts the system behavior in your favor. 